The beginning of November, we set out to create the longest, loudest thank you chain ever. And I have to say, I think it was a success. It's been so much fun to follow the thoughtful notes of gratitude and appreciation sent around the state and even beyond. If you've been following along, you know that we started this campaign with three community leaders and influencers, Governor Gary Herbert, Becky Higgins, and myself. Each of us wrote a thank you note to someone we appreciate. Our recipient did the same, and so it went. You are seeing the final chains on screen. A few familiar friends, but a lot of new faces too. The unexpected twists and turns made this campaign so much fun, like when Lisa Bernson, showed up on her high school English teacher's front porch, and that English teacher was none other than Phyllis Bester, mom to one of our favorite musical friends, Kurt Bester, or when Governor Herbert decided to thank Ronald Hawkins, someone he's been friends with for 63 years. And of course, we can't leave out our friends of the show that joined in on the fun. We love seeing photos from so many of them, so many of you, George Ann Bell, Jamie Cook, Chris and Andres, plus all of you viewers that picked up our custom cards from their lo local print shops. We are told most print shops ran out of all of those cards as you kind of dipped into that gratitude station stash and wrote a note of your own. So we are truly grateful to be surrounded by so many incredible people and for the chance that we have had as a staff to dig a little deeper and really focus on gratitude this month. Personally, I've seen um, more than the usual, more than the usual number of thank you cards come through my mailbox here at KSL Broadcast House. And for that, I'm personally grateful as well. So gratitude all around.